What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Fishkin Milligan. Today we're out here with Senor Jerry of JRZ Lures. What's up man? We're snooking around. Juan, what's up brother? Mauricio. We're with Captain Kayla. Got our JRZ Lures ready. We got Corkies, we got Top Waters. We're gonna be killing it from all angles here in Port Man. So until you guys get ready, it's gonna be a banger. Let's go. There we go. Yeah. Feels like it. Yeah. Along that edge, that grass line edge. Yes, sir. Hit soft, too. All right, guys. Nice little trout right here. Ooh, come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Dang, he just engulfed that, dude. All right, guys, that is the flame root beer, right? That's what it's called. He's just sucking it down. Look at that. Dang, Papa sucked it down. All right, guys, just caught one here on the flamed root beer with the salty head jig head. Yeah, a little bit. It's getting pretty deep right here. Keep moving right. There it is. Small one. Another one on the root beer, guys. All right, guys, for those of y'all wondering, salty head, one quarter ounce, using this flame root beer. Jersey lures, nice trout, probably uh, 15 and a half, 16, another borderline. There he goes. So what we're doing here is working this shoreline. We got like these tiny little islands here, but it's getting super deep and muddy off to the left here. So we're gonna hug this line here a little bit, see if we can't keep catching them. Uh, Mariso caught a flounder earlier. So, Caleb's gonna go slay. That's Captain Caleb, by the way. Saltwater Bandit Charters. You guys make sure to hook him up, man. Or I guess call him up. He'll hook you up. You call him up. We got some muddy bottom. Probably about eight to 12 inches of mud every step we take. And it's about chest high or so a little less for caleb because he's about six eight it's muddy, here. It's muddy? Yeah. i'm thinking it's about my it's right below my knees oh my gosh yeah it's up to my calf now real pretty in the sun got a nice little copper color to it and rocking that salty head it has some markings because that lure went way down deep in the trout 
and uh, I had to get it back. So, I had to do what I had to do. Beautiful day, guys, out here in Port Mansfield, Texas. Out here with Jerry RZ. There's, there's another one. Oh, he let it, he let it go. Another bite there, you let it go. The bite's real soft, guys. Real soft. They're chilling on the bottom. We're catching trout with red bellies. So I'm working this lure kind of soft. And kind of slow. For those of you who don't know, Port Mansfield is known for its big trout. So we're out here today, December 23rd, day before Christmas Eve, and check one. There's one. And we're trying to catch a big one. That doesn't seem too big. He's swimming right at me too. Oh, what came out? <laughs> Another one came out it's hard he's swimming right at me hey caleb two bites right now Hi. so should be okay working this spot yeah i know bro it's crazy uh today we're using the revo alf that I got from my buddy Rudy Saldon. Abu Garcia paired it up with the bare bones. This is a uh, medium light, great rod. Go call up Jeremy Hilpas, he'll help you out. Tell him Fishkin Milligan sent you. And uh, get yourself a nice trout rod, guys. This is a great little wading rod. Around seven foot, eight to 14 pound. And medium light and I'm really liking it man super sensitive I got it paired up with the fins 40 G braid and 30 pound and then I got a mono leader about 24 inches uni to uni knot there's another one there we go that's a better one Caleb oh he came off bro Damn, they keep hitting it like weird bro that's Okay. Oh, I see what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. You got a water in that yeah. So there's a crease in these islands, guys. There's an island here and then a crease and then some more islands. And this water's flowing through, he's saying. And a lot of times the trout, they're going to hang up, guys, in these spots where it's like a conveyor belt of bait just coming by. That was a good one, too. Man, I got to get a better hook set on that. Where are you at? Oh, that was another bite. Gosh. Another bite. Nothing? He was thinking up to like his knees. Caught a few on the flame root beer drop. Yeah. yeah. Have to do it your way, bro. What the? Bro, my, my lure hit the bottom, bite, pulled, broke off. Hey. Right, bro. <laughs> right over there, go check it out. You guys don't know what happened, but something broke the clean off. As soon as it hit the water, 
I got a bite and then boom, broke me off. Crazy. It came off? Yeah, yeah I wanted to, like, it was big, man. It was fat. <laughs> There we go. The modern mullet. Red. Alright guys, here we are. Waiting with Captain Caleb, snooking around. Also Jerry and Mauricio. We got ourselves a nice little redfish. Pretty little red. Salty head right in the corner of the mouth, boys. Hey right, guys, nice red here on the salty head 316 with the modern mullet from JRZ. Pretty red. Boom. Let's go. We ain't keeping any fish today because I forgot the stringer. So this guy right around 20. So I'm gonna let him go. There we go. Guys, another red just followed me up. Oh, another bite guy. Missed it. There it is. There it is. There it is. Oh, it came off, boys. Hey, Jerry, take me home. I suck. Yeah. Hey, let me get on your shoulder so I can see. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> hey, bring it up this time. That, now he's going down to get it. <laughs> there we go. Red with the uh, flame root beer because I ran out of mullet. <laughs> it's small though. Woo! We made a switch to another spot and we're out here just going parallel to the shoreline. Uh, I got my buddy Juan from Snooking Around YouTube channel. Make sure to go check him out, guys. Out here throwing the uh, root beer and the modern mullet. Those are the ones that have been getting the uh, bites for me today. We went ahead and switched it up to the Salty Head uh, Weedless because there's just a lot of grass around here. So y'all stay tuned. Hopefully we can hook up here pretty soon. Let's go. We're seeing some bait bust up here, guys. We're trying to slowly make our way up there. He's throwing a top water. And I got a tail right here. Yeah. So what we have here guys is a minor feed time. Right around 10 o'clock right now. So the bait is starting to move and hopefully the fish will start biting. And they'll, they'll stop short striking it because we've had a lot of short strikes today oh bro there it is nice good one man awesome dude Yeah, 
nice, bro. Get Nice red, bro. Woo. Uh, I just threw on the most random thing, bro. <laughs> it's just like a straight tail by uh by bear lure. God dang. Nah, he got himself a mouthful too. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Jeez. I know, man. I was like, shoot. I thought that top water was going to catch it, but. Ah, dang, boy. I was fishing in Baffin Bay. My dad caught like 30 trout on this weird little straight lure from mirror lure and i thought well let me try it and then sure enough catch this big old boy here so and i started seeing some little bait jump on this side too. right then my bell closed on me and it snapped the line oh no way like, but you recovered your top water don't lie please oh my god <laughs> Alright guys, that concludes our video here with Jerry from JRZ Lures, also snooking around Juan, and then we also got Captain Caleb, 6'8", tall captain. If he's wading and it's waist deep, then I need to get out of there, because that, that's too deep. So, huge thank you to uh, Jerry for taking us out today. Appreciate it, man. You guys make sure to check out JRZ Lures. We did really well today on the Modern Mullet, the Zombie and also the flaming root beer so and also make sure to check out Juan's channel snooking around uh, he caught a huge red on top water so you guys make sure to go check out his point of view on that one and thank you guys so much for tuning in we'll see you guys next time don't forget to like comment subscribe all that good stuff giveaways coming up so be sure to be on the lookout peace <laughs>